hi everyone welcome back to your part tutorial so today I am going to tell you how to fix the interop error so when we write the Excel code inside the invoke code activity so we generally find the assembly reference error so you can see that I, I have just write one code that is that will going to open the Excel file so this is the path that I have given of the Excel so if I'm going to run this code so you can see uh, I'm just facing are you missing assembly reference so f if you can see that I have already imported the namespace that microsoft.office.interop.excel you can import the name from here by typing microsoft.office and just double click on this the name will be imported in this panel so if you're going to search this thing you will find a different ways so in some form pages you will find that they will they will going to tell you that just add the assembly reference manually into the xaml file so let me show you so this is basically assembly that we have to put just after the compatibility compatibility so you can see I have just manually added this line if I go back to the code and just run this code again my code will work fine still running I got the message box so, so my file is open this is my file the test file but the problem here is if I'm going to change anything for example I have just used dot here if I'm going to change anything in this code editor and I'm trying to run this again then I will going to get the same error you can see so you for this you can just download send one more thing before this so the assembly reference that I have added manually you can see again in your cone so it is removed as I have just added after the compatibility and as soon as I implement the code the line get removed from here so the permanent solution is just go to this manage packages go to the all packages and write down microsoft dot office so th you have to install this microsoft dot office dot intro dot excel save it Now just I'm just running it again. I got the message. The file is opened. So let me retest it again. I'm just removing this dot again. I've changed this. Now, as I have implemented the code in the code editor, it should run fine again. I got the message. file is opened so this is how you can just fix the assembly reference error thanks for watching and 
if you have any query you can directly comment on my video thanks all